there is champion for the world. If I'm not good at this age, I can be good at 80. There's this guy, the second man in Apple. You know what he said? Larry Ellison. Say, it's my job for Oracle, the number two software company in the world, to become the number one software company. His job is beyond earning a salary or managing the place now. He's given himself a vision above the normal. He said, my job is to build better than the competition. Sell those products in the marketplace and eventually supplant Microsoft. And move from being number two to number one. What's your vision? That's the only thing that can give you a long-standing commitment. A vision that is above you. Number four. Once you discover what you're good at, you have to believe in yourself. Now let me tell you this. Everybody blow your trumpet. You don't know the song. You see? You don't believe in yourself. You can't sing in the choir. You can't hold a microphone. You can't even blow your trumpet. Everybody blow your trumpet. Exactly. Believe in yourself. How many people will succeed? I believe it. I will succeed. In something. In something. I will be known for something. You have to believe in yourself. That, that self-doubt is what can kill you. But when you believe in yourself, that propels you. That moves you on. So remember your assignment, three people. Hear what they have to say. And paraventure, there are people you can defer to so that they can encourage you. I can do it. I can do it. Number five, you have to be persistent. So when the going gets tough, the tough gets going. This is what persistence stands for. The ability to press on in the face of hardship. Without persistence, nothing can be achieved. You keep hitting at it. You keep hitting at it. I don't know the name of this guy that did a process and said he failed 9,999 times. And they said, how did you cope with the failure? I said, I didn't fail. The process had 10,000 steps. So all the 999 are processed to tell you that's not the way to do it. I said, nothing in the world can take the place of persistence. Nothing is more common than unsuccessful men with talent. The world is full of educated derelicts. Persistence and determination alone are the order of the day. A lot of people are talented, but they've given up. So they are building thorns. Now, number six. It's not just that you set goals, but set goals and execute them. Do a yearly, half-yearly, quarterly audit. Set goals and execute. Do a yearly, half-yearly, and quarterly audit. And involve other process, other people in the process of your auditing. What did we decide to do this year? X. How far have we gone this quarter? How far have we gone this half year? How far have we gone this year? That will help you to put yourself in check. You set goals and execute them. Number seven, you must learn to take risk. Robert Kiyosaki says, in today's rapidly changing world, the people who are not taking risks are, ri <laughs> are the risk takers. You can't stay in one position. And I want to advise you, I study the life of people because my passion is in training people and developing you. So I study the lives of people who have made it, who can be mentors. And I discover that most of them started what they are doing that we're talking about now before the age of 25. So if you're listening to me today, you're below 25. Good, good, good. You have more opportunities than us. They started before they were 25. Bill Gates, Steve Jobs, they all started before they were 25. Warren Buffet. There is a man, the Kentucky Fried Chicken, that started at 70. Okay? So that means that there's, there's hope for everyone. 
But more than 90% of them started below what age? 25. So you need to quickly recognize what you, you can do. Stay at it. Stay at it. Keep hitting it. For those of us who are already old, I told you the two ways to move. Either you take a leap or you take a swing. So we may need to take a swing. Hold on to one thing and swing to the other. Because if you take a leap, your whole family is still waiting for you. Do you understand what I'm saying? That would be irresponsible. So you must be able to take risk. Some of these great in, 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 um, investors, what they do is they share what they have into about four or five. They risk a portion. Because sometimes your investment go bad. But a young person, you can risk everything. Risk everything. Because if it goes bad, it's just you and your genes. Just move on. Amen. Number eight, you must learn to use feedback intelligently. Intelligence use of feedback. Whatever business you're doing, when your customer comes and tells you this is not good, don't frown. Many of you have lost opportunities because you fought that person. You should have admitted the customer is king. The customer is always right. So, intelligent use of feedback will take you to another level. Number nine, strong self-imposed standards. Strong self-imposed standards. Don't just do it the way everybody is doing it. Uniquely set some things for yourself. Strong self-imposed standards. Warren Buffett says it takes 20 years to build a reputation, but only five minutes to ruin it. If you think about that, you will do things differently. There are some things you just not do. You know what? Because I know I'm going to be so great, I will not falsify results. Because someday you will become speaker and they will discover that your certificate is Toronto. Do you understand what I'm saying? There are some things you won't do. Oh, I will not go and sleep in the house of a man that I'm going out with because peradventure it may rain and then we may be cold you understand I do not plan to fornicate but it may rain I know rain you can't stop rain rain is natural you cannot stop rain and when it rains you can be cold so I will deliberately keep a distance We'll be delighted and greatly inspired to talk into the books written by Takumo and Fumi Johnson. Get the best selling The Secret Black Book of Wealth by Fumi Johnson and start a journey into economic success. Must I Submit is another great book from Fumi Johnson with great insight into the man and wife question. And from Takumo Johnson comes the classic Life Out of the Box, also available as an audiobook. This telecast has been brought to you through the support of Chain TV Partners. For partnership, counseling and further inquiries, contact us at Chain TV, the Capstan Church with our walls, 360 Martela Mohammed Way, Yaba, Lagos. You can call us on telephone numbers 0802-318-2030 or 01-893-8243 or you can send an email to capstan underscore c at yahoo.com or help desk at thecapstoneonline.com You can also visit our website at www.thecapstoneonline.com Thank you for watching. Capstone,